Hello everyone. This video clip we are going to explore how to make a, a pictogram from a stack bar. So let's get started. You want a stack bar first. So highlight this area. Uh, by the way, this is about uh, the recommended number of um, water you should drink, which is eight glass. And uh, this is the number of the the water that each student uh, drinks each day okay so that's the story behind this graph now let's go ahead and insert a recommended charge i'm going to go for this stack uh, stack bar okay put it in the right location put it somewhere right here and then all you have to do is fill this bar with the glass the blue one is the one that they has been consumed and the, uh, the the gray one is the one that supposed to be but uh, as of the data collection it's not there okay so what we're gonna do is we're gonna click on this and suppose we don't see this this uh, window pane just remove it first I'm gonna go back and click on this blue one and then right click and go to format data series go to the view and line in the view option click on picture now, if well, this appear because it's it's the previous click bar that I have, but you can also uh, right click on this and then copy, okay? And then click on this, go back to the view again, and then just click on the click bar. It should place the glass right on the bar. Okay, it's not right because this is kind of stretching toward the bar, right? It's not what we actually want, so go down here and click on stack and scale width okay you need per picture how many one right now go ahead and do the same thing with this right click and copy into the clipboard click on this go to the uh, go to the view and line click on picture and texture view and then click on the clipboard and then go down here stack and scale there almost done okay now the glass are kind of small right right click and then again format data series now this time go to the third option which is series option the gap width is kind of too much we're going to reduce it to just only 10. press enter see now your glass look a lot taller because we decrease the space between each series so next thing that you want to tweak on this graph to make it look right is that you don't need this uh, this horizontal value because you know the glass itself is a pictogram right you can count them delete it you don't need this uh, legend delete it okay and also the uh, the series here should be in reverse because well, you don't want to start from student number four. You want to start from the recommend recommendation and then go down from student number one, two, three, and four. So I'm not sure which one. Let's see. Uh, okay, right click and then format access. Hmm. Oh, it is the, the fourth one, access option. Go and click on category in reverse order. Just click on it, click this checkbox. See? this is how it goes and let's see what else you don't need this vertical line right it's kind of annoying because you you only want to show the glasses icon uh, the glass icons so pick it the way to pick this one is probably the most difficult thing to pick okay so you're gonna end up picking something else see you can't really pick that line kind of hard to pick so I, I recommend you to just click on the chart, go to this option, and go to this horizontal value axis major grid line. See that? Major grid line. Click on view and then no line. That's it, folks. See, this is like almost, almost, almost done. But you need one more thing. You need to explain what you are showing. Okay. 
Okay. So eight glasses here. Make sure that you coordinate the color with your action color. So it's just somewhere here, I think. And then this is not easy to read. So make sure that you change it to align to the left and then move it to move it all the way to the left so that it will be easier for uh, water consumption is I'm not sure if we can okay okay just enter the number I uh, just enter to break the line eight glasses okay so I think that's about it